let's understand quickly how to solve geometry and menstruation question well the question is an inverted right circular cone has radius of 9 cm all right so this is the cone of radius 9 cm and this cone is partly filled with oil which is dipping from a hole right so ye jo inverted kiya gaya cone hai ye yahan se leak ho raha hai right theek hai so at the speed of 1 cm per hour okay currently the level of oil is 3 cm from the top so from the top to somewhere in the middle of the cone this is 3 cm right so this is given as 3 cm the surface area which is a part of your smaller cone is given as 36 pi right तो जो सरफेस एरिया होता है वो कोन का हमने ज्योमेट्री एंड मेजरेशन में पढ़ रखा है कि सरफेस एरिया ऑफ कोन इज गिवन बाय सरफेस एरिया ऑफ सर्कल और एरिया ऑफ सर्कल राइट सो द फर्स्ट पॉइंट वी नीड टू इक्वेट एज योर सरफेस एरिया ऑफ कोन इज गिवन एज पाई आर स्क्वायर सो दिस इज द सरफेस एरिया दैट वी शुड टेक आउट राइट क्योंकि ये तो बड़े वाले कोन की बात हो रही है बट जो भरा हुआ फिल्ड आउट पार्ट है वो वाले पार्ट का सरफेस एरिया होगा पाई आर स्क्वायर नाउ व्हिच इज गिवन एज 36 पाई एंड यूजिंग 36 पाई इज इक्वल टू पाई आर स्क्वायर आई कैन गेट द वैल्यू ऑफ आर व्हिच इज 6 Okay, let's read the question further. How long will it take the cone to be completely empty? In order to make this cone completely empty, we need to know what is volume of this cone, right? So, using your BPT theorem, that is basic proportionality theorem, we can equate two triangles, two different triangles. That is, if you can see on the screen, first triangle is triangle A, B, and C, and the second triangle is triangle M, B, and N. These are two different triangles, right? So, we need to equate their respective sides to find out radius and h. because in order to find out your volume of cone i need radius and h right this is the formula to find out your volume of cone now first of all we have already the value of r that is 6 and now we need value of h and that we are going to derive using your bpt theorem so if you look at this two triangles that is triangle abc and triangle abn i can take the ratio of side of first triangle to the side of second triangle that is ab by mb so this is ab by mb so ab is nothing but the height of the larger cone Which is three plus h. This is the height of the larger cone, and this is the height of smaller cone. So height of the larger cone that is ab, which is three plus h divided by height of the smaller cone that is h. This is we are doing using BPT, right? So to understand what is BPT, please watch other videos which is available on the same YouTube channel. And another ratio that I am taking is ac by mn. Those sides for which I know the values. So ac, which is the radius of the bigger triangle, bigger. cone and r is the radius of smaller triangle which we have already uh, in the question 9 by 6 which is after simplified you will be getting 3 by 2 and from this i can get the value of h now once i have both the value of r and h i can now find out vol volume of cone after putting this value you will get 72 pi as volume of cone now just put this value as your total volume of cone in terms of pi only you don't have to put the value of pi the question is how long will it take to completely